And now he's got a third and long. Hasn't had one of these today. Three wide receivers to his right. He's looking that way. Throws as he falls down. And what a catch. And it's complete. And it's Mitchell again. And it's a first down all the way down to the 19-yard line. Piece of the ball in the pocket. See how he swims. And Costello does a really nice job of taking the ball away from the rush. From the five-yard line with Colin Hill flanking him. Low snap. Had to pick it up. And now throws late across the middle, and he zips it out there for a first down. So let's not panic anywhere on this field, actually for both teams. I mean, if you're Washington State right now, you're going, hey. Whoa, Costello zips it out to the 43 to Javante Payton. He's doing great defense, playing the plays and that offense right there. They throw the jump ball, and they get the 50-50 ball. I'm not sure Derek Stingley Jr. lets that happen. No, probably not. But one of the things that I... Trying to get his man in motion, finally does. That's Peyton. Costello steps up. Going deep in middle, and caught! Boy. It was tipped even a little bit, but still brought down by Cameron Gardner. Watch him back into the zone. Turns and looks at the quarterback. Looks at the ball and says, I... Ah, not six foot four. Boy, great catch. Out, caught the back end of the ball. The Warriors marks in the backfield with Costello. KJ coming up fire and deep sideline. Caught. Beautiful over the shoulder catch by Osiris Mitchell again. Number 25. He's right there. He just at the last second, when the receiver puts his arms up, needs to turn. Mitchell does a good job of waiting until the last second. Me? The sidelines of beauty. And it's Tyrell Shavers' touchdown. <laughs> Told you they were running out of corners. Exactly. This is a pretty ball. And a great over-the-shoulder catch and right into the pylon. There he is, number 19. Costello throws complete. And it's a first down. Costello throws, lost one complete. On the run is Mitchell. Mitchell down the sideline. Touchdown, Bulldogs. He does his job. He stuffs it, and then he switches off, and that gave KJ the time to throw that ball, and it's a perfectly thrown ball right over the outstretch arm of Eli Ricks, right into the end zone. Set the throw again. Off his back foot, got it across the middle of Kylan Hill on a run. Hill broke a tackle at the 40, got away again, and all the way out near midfield. Castello comes up firing again, going to go deep again, and he's perfect again. Man. What a shot to Peyton. This is how college football has changed. Remember, LSU lived with the transferred quarterback all the way to a natural championship a year ago. Now they're getting burned with the transferred quarterback right now. It's been the gravy for Mississippi State so far. Third and long. Castello over the middle and again a perfect throw and it's Peyton again and he's all the way to the six yard line. They're getting the guy freed up by stunting around here but it's taking a little too long to get to him. Costello steps into the throw, man-to-man -man coverage, win at the line of scrimmage, and another third and long. And now it's first and goal. On first down. He's going to throw it to him, and he's wide open on the sideline if he can find his footing. Now big play, and he's still on his feet. Colin Hill down to the sideline. He is gone. Touchdown. 75 yards for the score. Because, boy, that saved a touchdown. That Rover got his arm on him, saved a touchdown. And Costello comes up firing again, and he goes, I like this guy, zero, Javante Payton. Colin Hill in the backfield with Costello. He comes up throwing, completes it again and again. He's got it to Austin Williams, and he's got it first and goal. Costello looked left, lobs it to the corner, a touchdown. 500 yards passing, and Austin Williams for the score. Right there, he's just going to go out this way and cross. Perfect throw, man-to-man -man coverage again, and he gets beat. Like, you've got to show the leadership. Costello, the throw on the flat to Kylan Hill. He's got a big gainer again. Less than 22,000 here, and I'm not sure there's that many here now. Costello on a crossing route has got it complete. And here's his main man again. 
Shavers, who had a big touchdown earlier, and he goes all the way down to the 21-yard line. Is the whole play clock or not? I don't think they care. Costello pump fakes one way, deep middle, and what a throw and catch Williams. First down. On this play right here, he's had those short passing games all game, goes out, stalls, and then a perfect throw right in the body. When that tight coverage like that, you can do it. That's the execution. It's man they rub. If it's zone, they stop. Now well, they do use the play clock all the way down. Costello there over is. the middle, and there he goes again. And we saw this last time for 37 yards, and this time it goes all the way to the 26-yard line. I love to cross those receivers. It's almost like beating the, the, the going deep with bump and run coverage. They just go wide on bump and run coverage. Why did the middle of the field to the other side? Just run away from the coverage. If it's man, you know you got him. Third and nine. Costello going to go long to the corner of the end zone. Touchdown, Mitchell. Another huge third down play. Touchdown number five for K.J. Costello. Three touchdowns against LSU's defense on third and long. Stutter and go. Really bad technique that time. Barely got his hands on him. Was out of phase before he even moved. A pair of fives, but it's the Maroon five that wins it. 623 passing yards and another touchdown here. He stalls. He doesn't really impede the receiver. He thinks he's going short. He guesses a short route. And after K.J. Costello throws for over 600 yards, he goes, you know, I might have to try to have to find where Starkville was on the map, <laughs> but I'm glad I found it. AJ Costello saying, where's my helmet? I may have to go back out there. I don't think so. 623 yards passing, an SEC record, 11th most ever in college football history. And it's an SEC West game. Come on, really?